everybody. My name is Wendy Ford from Cash Life Mastery, and you are joining us today on Cash Life Mastery Social Juice. And today we're talking Twitter chats for newbies and how to use twubs for branding. And today my co-host Keith Keller is joining us, and he is going to um, give us some twubs loving <laughs> and tell us how. Oh, well. <laughs> tell, yeah, say that three times fast. Twubs love, twubs love, twubs love. <laughs> Um, he's going to tell us how we can uh, really dive into TWUBS. But before we do, I'm going to talk a little bit about branding today. I had a really interesting conversation with one of my clients today, and it was just so uh, neat that this fell into the same topic that we're talking about on Blab tonight. And the question that she had for me is, should I brand myself or should I brand my business? And this is one thing that I really want to talk to you guys before you get out there and start using social media platforms to brand yourself, which is something you really need to do. Um, make sure that you have got yourself niched down. Um, yeah. This girl had uh, probably about four or five different things that she was into, which is fine, but she really wasn't sure how to uh, brand herself and still promote all of her products because some things did not really uh, mesh into others. You know, she wanted to be a life coach, which she hasn't promoted yet, but yet she had a lot of affiliate products, one of them being coffee. And so coffee and life coaching to me just really, you know, on the same website, don't go together. <laughs> so my advice yeah. to her was what you really need to do is niche yourself down make sure with your coaching because at first she was like well i want to coach people about business and i said well okay what about business you know do you have specific topics like uh keith is the twitter king you know he's he's basically the person that you go to for twitter um you know i know several other people who are like youtube gurus you know if i had a problem with youtube which I did yesterday, <laughs> I would go to those people. Um, and, you know, but basically like what I do is I teach people to bootstrap their business. So I know a little bit about everything and I know how to get things cheaper, better, useful, not useful and give that type of advice. And she's like, well, I don't really think I want to talk about business then. And I said, well, what do you want to do? She's like, well, I want to give people advice and motivate them. And I said, well, it kind of sounds like you want to be a life coach. She's like, yeah, yeah. You know, so it really took that conversation with her to yeah, get the yeah. idea of how to kind of brand herself down, niche herself down is what I call it, and, and get her to a focused area. And I said, then from there, you can maybe start another website you know, that's not in your name because she already had her name.com. I said, start another website that's focused at coffee or focused at whatever other products mm. that you want to have, but use your, your name.com for your life coaching because that makes more sense. Um, so that is one thing that I really want you guys to think about before you start creating these hashtags that we're going to talk about tonight. Yeah. Yep. Um, because like for me, my hashtag is hashtag cash life mastery. Go figure. It's my business. I own it. So yes, I brand my business. Normally I tell you to brand yourself um, because you know, that's it, it's, it's you. Nobody can take that away. If you change what you're doing, then you don't have to go change your website and everything else. Unless you have your own business. Like I do cash life mastery. I'm branding both the business and myself. But if you're selling candles, you don't want to brand yourself with that company that's selling candles. You want to brand you, your name. Um, you have your own website? Yes, I actually do. Not open, but I do have it. <laughs> I do have it. And it's a very then, good case in point. Yeah. So, you know, it's, it's just, it's about narrowing things down because people want to come to experts. You know, like for me, if you want to know how to bootstrap your business, you come to me. If you want to know about Twitter, you come to Keith. You want an expert in um, YouTube, you know, uh, I think uh, 
Roberto Blake, he's the first person I can think of who's awesome with YouTube. Um, you know, you guys are someone like that who, who is specializing in that area. So, you know, that's, that's really the key to branding is getting your niche down, knowing what you're really yeah. good at, and then focusing everything you do from there. And with that said, Keith and I are going to talk to you about picking really um, pertinent hashtags, using them on TWUBs, and using them in Twitter chats. So, Keith, I'm going to let you take it away. <laughs> that, that was an extremely interesting introduction because lots and lots of people are stuck with that idea. I've given you some examples there. Cashlifemastery.com is Wendy's business name. Now, uh, Mike in Calgary said, well, what if you walk away? Wendy could walk away. No one needs to know that that's her business. Cash Life Mastery doesn't mention her name. Someone can pick that up and bring it, move it on. Uh, my business name is globalsocialmediacoaching.com. Someone could pick that up and move with it if they wanted to, but I went and bought the URL and pointed it at it, keithkeller.com.au, because I'm the dude. I'm the king of Twitter. If yeah. you want to know about Twitter, I'm setting myself up as the guy to go to. <coughs> it's a very good case in point. Global Social Media Coaching has a blog about all sorts of things, websites and YouTube and SEO and all sorts of funky things, which are really cool. But if you want to know about Twitter, I have an ebook. I have a website. Yeah. I have a podcast. So it's a very good case in point if you want to, you have to make that decision. And with that, uh, let's talk about branding and the idea of how TWUBs can help. So let me set some context. On Twitter, as it stands, March 2016, there are 20, 270 million active users. 270 million people log into Twitter every month and look around. Now that's a big number. That in itself is worth chunking around with. Facebook, as we know, has 1.5 billion people, but it's a totally different platform. So now that you know that there's 270 million people there hanging around, I want to. I want you to play around with this, and I'll, I'll get to this question in a minute. I want you to play around with this thought. There are nine thousand tweets a second. There are nine thousand tweets every second of the day from two hundred seventy million people. So unless you have some strategies, I'm, I'm going to get to this in a minute. That's not technically what today's show is about. I'll get to that in the after show party. So how are you going to manage Twitter with 9,000 tweets a second? And please don't go away, Bruno. I got your question there, but we're talking today about TWUBs, and I really want to pick up on that because that's what today's show is about. But I will answer your question. So TWUBs, T-W-U-B-S dot com, it's a Twitter club, a club where people hang out on Twitter, is a place which I've discovered years ago now where we can actually make our web uh, our TWUBS page look awesome. It, I mean, it's yeah. not just it's not just brilliant. It's mind-blowingly awesome. Now, today I, I played around. This is so cool. TWUBS.com takes a hashtag and turns it into a lovely page, which you can if you want to, and it only takes about an hour. You can add graphics. You can change around the photos. You can add your little bio. If you're very clever, you could probably do that in ten minutes. It, yeah. it took me. It took me an hour because I'm a dumbass. But the point is that here we got this really, really, really cool site. Twitter tips for newbies is the hashtag. But what Twubs does? This is so clever. What Twubs does is it actually takes that hashtag. And it actually makes a really, really, really lovely page. So if you're listening to the recording, I want you to go to twubs.com forward slash Twitter tips for newbies. And, I'll, and everything that I'm going to explain today is there. We've also got twubs.com forward slash cash, cash life mastery. If you're listening to the recording, if, you, if you're watching live, I want you to go and have a look at these sites just so that you know what I'm talking about. I mean, they look We're magnificent. We're just those started, guys. So you can imagine if you um, have, have been doing it for a while, how much engagement you can get off of this. 
it's a lovely place where you can put all of your um yeah so the, the thing i discovered today which is not new but it was new for me and i don't even know if wendy knows this is so cool you can embed a blab in a twub yes i, saw, just say that. That I saw that you did that that looks so cool oh, you can embed a twub in a blog now you can embed a blab in a tw twub so that what is that that's not a blob it's not a blab it's not a vlog it's a it's a twab maybe it's a twab so yeah, what i'm saying fine. here is <laughs> is you've got this lovely looking page and the world is buzzing by remember there's nine thousand tweets a second the world is buzzing by and when we're all we're all starting to get depressed that no one's looking at our stuff anymore because there's so much stuff. So but imagine if you found this really lovely page, one site, tobs.com forward slash something, and that's your home base. That's your, it's not a website, but it's a lovely place to have your events, to have your blabs, to have your blog, or your blog talk radio. You can subscribe there just like you do like on your Facebook page, but you're doing it with Twitter. You know, you can have everybody joining in and, and using your hashtag. So anything they tweet comes up in your club. Good Lord, that's. <laughs> I know, look, I know it's complex, but let me, let me break it down. You can do nothing and you're just going to get lost in the wash. And this actually picks up exactly what Bruno's talking about. There's 9,000 tweets a second. There's 270 million people floating around in Twitter. This one tool, which is free, it has a very robust free version. I think you can set up about 10 or 20 of these little sites if you've got little events going on, is free to get started. And then obviously they've got to make some money and they have a paid version. Here's a way that you can make your page look really lovely. And again, stand out from the crowd. We're all about standing out from the crowd, making sure that when you go to an event, when you write a book, if you've got a radio show, if you've got a gig in the city, that you can make people come to your gig rather than his gig, buy your T-shirt rather than that T-shirt, or buy your book rather than the hundreds of other books that you see at the airport. And it's a bit of a game. Um, it's a bit of a game, and we play this game, and I just wanted to share this. I wanted to do this blab specifically about this site because it is such a game changer and I won't talk forever about it. It's just simply twubs.com is the site itself. My version of that is twubs.com forward slash Twitter tips for newbies. I'm sort of taking ownership of that one and playing around with it. Wendy's taking ownership of Cash Life Mastery and playing around with it. You can see that we've used slightly different colors, slightly different graphics, and you can see this evolve over time. And all you need to do, this is the cool thing, all you need to do is when you're doing your tweets, just add that hashtag and it will automatically show up in this page forever. And you'll just be able to, it's like a little repository of all your tweets. So I want you to start playing around with that. I'm gonna, I'm going to uh, send you back to Wendy to wrap this section up and then we'll go into the after show party because this section is really only about 15 to 20 minutes. Uh, what are your thoughts on that, Wendy? And, and what, we're not, because I only introduced you to this a couple of weeks ago. Have you, have you, have you got your head around how we can use it? Yeah, I mean, I think honestly, just from what I'm seeing from Twubs, I really think that, you know, by creating your hashtag with your brand or, you know, with your name or whatever um, keyword resonates with your business, then you're basically going to be able to build your own little community on Twitter so you don't have yeah. to, you know, you just filter out some of that noise and get down to the meat of what you want to hear, you know, if you can that's get exactly your tribe right. involved, you know, if you can get your tribe involved, then I really think that that's going to, um, going to really turn it into like your own little community. What is the core outcome of engaging in a twab in a twubs? Okay. Engagement is the engage, the engagement is the end result. Engagement is currency. Engagement is the point. And actually, I want to I want to mention this in the recording. I want to go on record yeah. as saying this: Twitter is not for selling. You can quote me on that, and I'm happy to be strung up in the main street because of that. Twitter is not for selling. Twitter is for engaging. 
The point of Twitter is to take people away from your a Twitter account and send them to a free ebook. Send them to your website, send them to your blog, get them to come to your event. And when they're at their event, have a cup of coffee with them. What I really, 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 really hate in big capital letters is when people try to sell me stuff in these automated DMs that don't even know me. Yeah. Uh, Twitter, well, for, Twitter is for I, building relationships with people, isn't it? Yes. I think it's more about um, putting like maybe your free offer and getting them to opt into your website, you know, something along that lines. But you, it's a, Twitter's a relationship builder and it's a way to draw people to you, not really the place to um, straight up sell, I don't think. Yeah, no, I totally agree. And and like I, I am, a, I'm sorry, Mike, I got a bit on my soapbox there, but uh, I, I really don't want you to be a used car salesman and go for the jugular two minutes after someone joins. I love Twitter. I've been here for six years, but when I talk to people, I ring them, I Skype them, I email them, and we chat via DMs or whatever. But I never ever sell in the open forum ever. Okay, I get excited. <laughs> So let's go ahead and wrap this up and get off the recording. Yep. We can go to the after party and let people in. So Keith, tell everybody how they can reach you. Yeah. Okay. So my name is Keith Keller, K-E-I-T-H-K-E-L-L-E-R. I have a free ebook. It's completely free. All you need is to sign up. You get a free ebook on day one and 12 emails once a week for 12 weeks, uh, completely free with some little teasers virtually everything I know up until that point. And that is available at keithkeller.com.au, keithkeller.com.au. And don't forget the AU because I'm in Australia and someone else has the .com and I'm trying to get it back. And you can also <laughs> find me on Twitter at Keith Keller. And I chat, I, ch I chat there. People who know me know that I really, really engage there. And that's the point. But Wendy has some ideas too. She's got a website, a cool, uh, a cool uh, Twitter account, and now a Tob's room. Yes, definitely. So, guys, you can reach me. My name is Wendy Four from Cash Life Mastery, where we're teaching people to um, entrepreneurs to come into profit. Basically, is what our main goal and theme is. So, if you're having issues along that line with your business, please reach out. Right now, guys, I'm telling everybody to reach me at Cash Life Mastery on Facebook because our website is under construction. We've got some new and awesome things coming uh, to you at CashLifeMastery.com, and we can't wait to tell you about that down the road. But at the for the moment, uh, contact me, Cash Life Mastery, um, on Facebook or Cash Life Mastery on Twitter, and Twubs.com backslash Cash Life Mastery now. And we'd love to have you using the hashtag Cash Life Mastery so you can be a uh, part of our conversation. And today, guys, thanks for joining us. Cash Life Mastery Social Juice, talking about Twitter chats for newbies.